Worldview with Dennis Campbell is made possible by listeners and viewers like you. To get an advert-free version of the show, plus all of our member benefits, please visit our website at www.worldviewshow.com. Live on tape without a studio audience from South Wales, it's World View with Dennis Campbell. Welcome to World View for the week of April 15, 2013. I'm Dennis Campbell. Now, it's hard to believe that it was three years ago this week an Icelandic volcano we still cannot pronounce erupted wreaking havoc across the EU as all air travel was grounded for weeks. Also, we remember the passing of the world's most famous secondary school maths failure. But things ended relatively well for him. Dr. Albert Einstein passed away in 1955. And movie actress Royal became one for real, as Grace Kelly married Monaco's Prince Rainier in 1956. And in 1862, Louis Pasteur and Claude Bernard completed the first test of pasteurization. And speaking of pasteurization, have you ever wondered about what is in your milk? Well, there's a raging debate in the USA on the quality and safety of so-called raw milk versus big food produced pasteurized, and indeed super pasteurized, and as an aside, unrecognizable as milk or anything you would want to drink, milk and whey products. We're going to visit with Pete Kennedy, an attorney and president of the Farm to Consumer Legal Defense Fund. Now, he works on dairy issues for the Western A. Price Foundation, which is leading the way to have an intrastate ban on the transport of raw milk lifted and allow this more natural milk into stores across the USA. We'll also look at the continued demonization of raw milk by big food, especially via a flawed U.S. Center for Disease Control study, which benefits big food, who controls most of the pasteurized milk in the USA. Robert Hunziker joins us with part two of his climate danger top ten. Now, part one was absolutely terrifying. I mean, you think of skiing downhill on sand as opposed to snow. And this segment is even more frightening and hopefully will awaken you. The Monday Line this week bids farewell to Margaret Thatcher, as she, as she is simultaneously canonized and vilified. And since so many of our viewers are outside of the UK, we're going to focus most of your first of exposure to the nation, that via air transport into one of our many airports. Malcolm Ginsburg of Business Travel News is going to join us to give his thoughts on the Iron Lady and her role in British aviation. Now, how much time do you spend waiting at traffic lights? Ian Perry, <clears throat> formerly with the Global Alliance for Eco-Mobility, a transport and planning expert, joins us to discuss the need for proper traffic flow and bicycle access planning in this time of record petrol pipes at the pump. Now, because of illness last week, this time it was me fighting a nasty lung infection, our student partners at UWC Atlantic College have their first full package ready for this week's program. They're going to be looking at the impact of gay marriage around the world. And we present Worldview with Dennis Campbell in partnership with that UWC college here in South Wales. They're an international school bringing students together from 90 countries around the globe. This Friday, I will deliver an In the Editor's Chair lecture at Cardiff University's Jomex School of Journalism, Media and Communication. We hope to add them as a partner school going forward. Now, our goal here is to expand your view of what's happening in the larger, broader world. Where national news gives someone a minute or so to speak, our segments run 8 to 10 minutes so we can thoroughly discuss an issue of interest. Simply, we respect your intelligence, and we assume you have an attention span of more than 30 seconds. We're grateful to those who support independent media and all those who help us along the way. The banner and logo behind me were created by Peter Barrier Thiel, and you can reach him at www.peterbeerthiel. That's U-R-T-H-E-I-L dot com. And the voiceover on this intro is done by Gerald with a G Price. You can find his work at www.geraldprice.co.uk. Peter and Gerald, they donated their services to help keep independent media free and strong. So please do try to help them. We're also very grateful to Caroline Criado Perez in the women's room for helping us find great media interview resources via their website, www.thewomensroom.org.uk.
Now, you can find us on Twitter at Worldview Show and Facebook.com slash Worldview Show. Please follow us on both of those websites. And you can watch clips of our shows at any time on YouTube.com slash Worldview Show. Please tell your friends about our channel. We'd love to hear from you. Our email address is worldviewshow at gmail.com. Coming up next, Pete Kennedy on Fresh Farm Raw Milk. We drink it here and you should too, but most likely you cannot because of old fears and silly laws. You're watching Worldview with Dennis Campbell. Keep it right here.